Well, this is a promotion video about our latest work of the ChatGPT's fake news journey, and uh, our paper title is uh, "From Creation to Clarification: ChatGPT's Journey Through the Fake News Quagmire." Um, currently, I'm an upcoming PhD student at University of Notre Dame. So firstly, uh, let's delve into the generation of fake news of ChatGPT. And uh, in our paper, we identified uh, four kinds of methods for uh, fake news generation. Uh, these are altering text meaning, inventing stories, creating imaginary texts, and uh, multiple prompts. After conducting human evaluation, uh, we just uh, defined uh, different reasons for why people think a given news is fake. So the first, of, uh, the most frequent reason is lack of evidence or credible source. Uh, that is about a kind of a statement uh, uh, is not supported by enough evidence or uh, source. Um, so then we come into the explanation of fake news and uh, in this section uh, we define lots of reasons uh, to explain the fake news and uh, uh, for example uh, we can see one reason is emotional bias or misleading intent and uh, uh, this explanation suggests that the fake news is characterized by an emotional bias or another reason is conflicting facts and this reason suggests that the fake news conflicts with uh, established established facts such as wrong information about people or events so based on the explanation of fake news we just propose a kind of prompt method to improve the chat GPT's detection ability of fake news and uh, uh, after um, in after injecting the knowledge about the explanation summary or uh, explanation reason uh, to the prompt, uh, ChatGPT's fake news detection ability is improved significantly. So based on extensive ex experiments um, on uh, different fake news that said we can observe that, that this kind of method works well. So uh, this is all about our uh, work, so thanks a lot.